Awesome. All right. Welcome to tonight's Get Your Oils On. We have lots of leaders doing this talk together. I'm Pamela Hunter, a diamond in Young Living, your diamond with fun, love, and wellness. And so we've got Dawn right over here. And Dawn is a silver leader. We've got Stacy Van. Wave, Stace. She's a gold leader. We've got Shannon Chatta. She's a silver leader. We've got Jackie <laughs> Lebrec. She's a silver leader and a bridge to gold. She's halfway there. And Joanna. And she's a silver leader. And then we have Julie Mackey. And Julie is a executive leader. And we have Annette Clausen. And Annette is a platinum leader. So we're all here to share the premium starter kit in the US market and show you more ways and tell you stories today about the oils in our own voices and our authentic selves to show you how we look at this premium starter kit. So I'm going to take it and unbox it. Here it is. So you open up these little gold tabs become very important because every gold tab you see you open it and lift it and right away Voila, there comes 10 essential oils looking at you. And these 10 essential oils are a beautiful combination to get started with. So I hold it up there really close and I tell you how I look at this kit in a very quick way. And how I do it is this row of Valor and Panaway. They remind me to move freely. Really helpful to a muscular part of our body. Then we have peppermint and digize, and that's digesting with grace and ease. Then we have thieves and raven, and that's breathing deeply. And then we have lemon and citrus fresh, and that is bringing in the sunshine. Lavender and frankincense are live joyfully. The king and queen are at that very last part. So we're going to go through this entire kit to show you how ways that you can enjoy your oils. And we also will show you what is behind the trap door because there's two more oils and some goodies behind there. So to get started, I'm going to pass the buck to Jackie. Jackie. Good evening, everyone. I am going to tell you the three ways in which we can use the oils in our premium starter kit. The first one is through our diffusion. Here is our desert mist diffuser, and inside I poured the water and a little bit of bergamot for us for this evening, just because it was a fun oil, something different. Um, you can also apply them topically. So I like to take my oil and drop it in the palm of my hand, rub it clockwise three times, and then apply it wherever I want it to be. So over my heart, on my muscles, on my stomach, wherever you might want to apply it. The third way is internally ingesting those oils that are deemed um, grass and that are our vitality oils. So you'll see here that the yellow jacket means that they're vitality oils and I can drink those or ingest them. How would I use that? Take a glass of water, put a couple drops in my water and drink it throughout the day. I could also place it in a capsule and ingest it as a supplement, or I could add it to any type of food, yogurt, applesauce, um, go back to beverages, Ninja Red, and it's a yummy, yummy treat. And I can also add my Vitality oils to when I cook. So there are just three different ways in which you can use the oils that come in your starter kit aromatically, topically, or internally. And now I am passing this off to Stacy to tell us all about why we should be using Young Living essential oil. Hi everyone. I have been a member of Young Living Essential Oils since 2002. The three main reasons for young, why Young Living for me is number one, I know where my oils come from. Number two, our amazing community. And number three, our five by five pledge. 
Number one, knowing where our oils come from. We have global farms all over the world. And as a member of Young Living, we can visit those farms. You can plant, you can see how they're distilled and get to know our seed to seal process. And Gary Young is the modern leader in the essential oil movement. For over 35 years, he's dedicated his life and his now legacy to bringing essential oils into every home, which is part of our mission. And we are successfully doing that with millions around the world joining our community to bring health and wellness, wellness, purpose, and abundance into every home. So the seed to seal this is our commitment to ensure that you have a pure essential oil in your family's home. So it's from planting, growing, harvesting, distilling, and producing the essential oils. And you can learn more about this process at seedtoseal.com. Our amazing community, the fun, love, and wellness community offering education. Our Facebook page is, I am amazed at all of the information and the participation that we have to bring you education about our products, our you know, ranging in not only our essential oils, our supplements, our CBD products, our um, skin care. It's amazing because it's a lifestyle. And then also our global community where we participate in yearly conventions. And this year you can join us on a virtual convention that's happening in June. And you can find out more information about that as well at youngliving.com. And finally, the five by five pledge, which is one of my favorites that they announced in 2019. And that's to have five times more people empowered by the D. Geary Young Living Foundation. And the foundation is empowering lives every year, serving the underserved, including rescuing women and children from human trafficking and providing families with tools to prevent malaria. Also five years to zero waste. We're one of the industry's green leaders and we take the stewardship of our planet really seriously. And our commitment is evidenced in the seed to seal process I mentioned to you. And so in the next five years, we've committed to a zero waste policy. That's incredible. And it moves me greatly. As well every year to garner five or more corporate owned or partner farms. So we continue our collaboration in every place that we bring a farm, we bring jobs and we're protecting and preserving the land with our seed to seal process. We also are committed to opening five or new markets opened every year. It's amazing. We've just opened up into Brazil. We also are committed to reaching within five years, 5 million more additional households to allow young living into their hands. So again, my three whys is I know where the oils come from. We can go and visit our farms and see the seed to seal process ourselves. Again, number two, our amazing community, the fun, love and wellness community and our global family of young living members all over the world. And third, our five by five pledge. Thank you so much. And I'm passing on to, oh wait, no, I get to do Valor now, don't I? <laughs> I'm doing Valor, we're not passing on yet. Passing on to myself, I'm gonna pass on to myself. <laughs> and introduce Valor, which this is one of D. Gary Young, who's the founder of Young Living, um, his favorite oils. And it's one of my favorites as well. It's part of my everyday protocol. It's part of how I begin my day and often how I'll end my day. My favorite way to put on Valor, and it's known as chiropractic in a bottle. Again, Pam mentioned how to move freely to support your muscles. It's also wonderful to give courage and confidence. It's also a very grounding oil. It has in it four different oils of black spruce and rosewood or sorry, just spruce, rosewood, blue tansy, and frankincense. And it's cool, you can see the blue tansy. If you can see the oil's blue, it's blue. One of my favorite places to put it, right? Rubbing my palms, 
taking a moment to smell that beautiful aroma. I like to place it on my heart. I like to place it on the back of my neck. I always love to put the oils through my hair. And then one of my favorite places to put it is on the bottom of my feet. Put it on the spine of my foot that's on the inside of your foot from your big toe to your heel. So I'm going to put that on right now. You can't, I'm not going to show you my feet right now, but <laughs> that's my favorite places to put the Valor. And again, it's an oil that is so supportive for having you face the day with an open heart. So now I'm going to pass on why we're going to do the pan away to Julie. Oh, Julie's muted. Julie, you got to mute. There you go. I got my pan away here. And being a CrossFit athlete and working out quite intensely, this is one of my favorite oils for muscular skeletal support. So I like to pair this oil with um, different other products, such as Deep Relief, which was the promo this month. It's a rollerball that also enhances that muscular skeletal support. And I also pair it with our CBD balm. And I ordered this as a little Father's Day gift this month, which has cool azul in it. So this is a nice little dop kit, I think, for my male athletes that I work with or dads in our life. And this cool azul is another one that I love to pair with the Panaway. Um, it also has a bunch of oils here with some rollerball fitness on the side. So that's just a little side PSA. Um, but the three things that I like to use Panaway for are um, foot scrub. I made a um, olive oil, brown sugar, and Panaway scrub for my feet the other day. And it was the pedicure that I needed since the salons are not open yet. I also like to um, put it in the bath. So when I'm really sore, and then I love to pair it with those other products. So um, another thing that is great to do, if you like to do warm and cold compresses, this oil is a great partnership for that. So you can place it with a um, hot water bottle and a towel, or you can just do a washcloth and wet it and put this oil on with hot water or cool. So you can do either type of compress the way that you um, are looking for that um feeling so hi those people that are popping on so i am passing off to dawn <laughs> hi i'm dawn and i am going to talk to you about peppermint vitality peppermint vitality is important in my life because when my daughter was 15 years old overnight she developed five life-threatening food allergies she had never been allergic to anything before and along with the diagnosis of these allergies, she started to have a lot of abdominal pain. And she had $25,000 worth of medical tests trying to figure out what was going on. And nobody could come up with an answer. And I had this little bottle of peppermint in the drawer in my house, not getting much use. And I said, you know what? People say it's really supportive for healthy digestion. Everyone says you don't have anything going on. Let's do a little experiment. We'll put a drop or two into a glass of water and every time you eat something, I want you to sip just a little bit of it. And so she did and it was life-changing for her. And I always say it was life-changing for her for two reasons. One, because peppermint was really supportive to her healthy digestive system. And number two, it gave her something to believe in and something to trust. Every time she put those drops into the water, she trusted that it would help her, and it did. So other uses for peppermint, it is brilliant to diffuse peppermint when you need to stay alert. So if you're having a dozy afternoon and you are having trouble focusing, put a couple drops of peppermint into your diffuser. Or maybe just put a couple drops of peppermint into the palm of your hands and sniff it and really wake yourself up. Peppermint is really good to take with when you travel because when we travel, we move a lot. We move in cars, we move in airplanes, we move in boats, we might move in a circle, and we can just apply a little bit of peppermint. My little trick with peppermint when I'm moving a lot, like we just mentioned, is to put it into the palm of my hand and tap right here above my lip 
underneath my nose and you will feel magnificent. And then last, peppermint is amazing to cool us down when we get a little bit overheated. So if you're outside this summer doing some gardening or you're watching a sporting event and you start to feel your body heating up, take a couple drops of that peppermint and apply it on the back of your neck, maybe even to your wrists and it will cool you right down. So that's peppermint, and I'm going to pass this digize off to Jackie. Good catch. You're muted. You're muted. You're muted, Jackie. Sorry. I do have a lot of baseball players in my house. That's why I'm so good at catch. Thank you, Don. I appreciate that. My oil that I would like to talk to you about is digize. Now, Digize comes in this little jacket in the starter kit, but it also comes in a full jacket when you order separately. And the reason I love Digize is because when I started a long, long time ago, eight years ago, well, 12 years ago now, but probably about eight years ago, my sister was visiting and she and I were both lamenting about how full our stomach was after our large meal and how bloated we felt and how icky we felt and she wasn't an oil user so I grabbed my digize and I put it on my belly and immediately I felt better and she's like I want to try some of that so after that visit she was a believer with me on the power of digize and helping your digestive system start working and relieving all that bloating and the added stuff you have in your in your stomach it also helps with the digestion and getting it through your system. So when a lot of people will use peppermint because they may not necessarily like the smell of this oil, which is a blend of tarragon, ginger, peppermint, juniper, fennel, lemongrass, anise, and patchouli, they will use the peppermint. But I choose to use the digize because I know it's the big one, the big kahuna. So. That's why I, and how I let use Digize and why I use Digize. So now I am going to send Thieves to Dawn. Catch. Oh, not Dawn, I'm sorry, Joanna. <laughs> Catch. Got it. All right. Ooh. Hey everybody, I'm Joanna Nunes. This is Thieves Vitality. This is the oil that comes in the premium starter kit. I'm gonna jump right in because we know that Thieves is very popular and, and has many uses these days. First, my testimonial about Thieves is, if any of you have ever heard of throat coat tea, my life-saving tea was made with a couple drops of Thieves Vitality in my cup of tea or even hot water, some lemon or lemon vitality, essential oil, and some honey. And I usually use the honey as the carrier and stir it around and take sips of that. Not only is it delicious, it's, it's the most powerful way to calm down anything that may be going on in through here that you're starting to feel for whatever reason, changes seasons, singing too much, yelling too much, whatever that may be for you. So Thieves Vitality to the rescue in your tea. Three ways. The first way is rainy days and wet basements. If you know what I mean, we've had a lot of rainy days and many of you unfortunately have had wet basements. And what goes along with that are things that start to grow and maybe turn green. And I think you know what I mean by that. For that, you'd want to diffuse quite a bit. Now, I'm holding up the regular label, Thieves, which you can diffuse either one. I think it's important that we know that these two bottles of Thieves if we were to pour the oil out, they very well could have come from the same distillation, but we know that one says essential oil supplement for ingestion, the other one is for things like diffusing. So that's that, so diffusing for rainy days and wet basements. The second way is for whole body immune support. The oils in Thieves are clove, cinnamon bark, eucalyptus, lemon, and rosemary. And if you aren't, very aware of what each of those individual oils do to support our immune system, I recommend that you get a good reference guide or look them up in your reference guide, but there's a reason why all of those oils are in this particular blend. So with that, 
when you're diffusing and inhaling the molecules, you're helping to support your immune system through that inhalation and those molecules going systemic through the body. The second way is taking your vitality thieves and putting, putting them in a capsule, a couple drops a day and ingesting that way. What we do in the Nunes household so that we're not spilling thieves oil in veggie capsules where you're feeling them going down the throat, all over your fingers and your lips, is we just get inner defense supplement because each of these capsules um, have the thieves blend in it with the addition of um, thyme and oregano. So it really, I'm going to open this up, it really, really helps to... Um, get you through times of change of season and when the kids are not in school, well, not for this reason, but typical times in our lives when the kids and classrooms are emptying for whatever's going on. And it's in a capsule that knows to open when it gets into the gut. That's what's beautiful about it. So you're not belching anything up, but it does the trick. So that's the second way for immune support. And the third way we like to do is the bottoms of the feet. And that's when I grab my thieves roll on because I think it's important we get our kids in integrated in using essential oils. And one of the easy ways to do it for our kids using Thieves is with an already diluted Thieves roll-on. Sit in butterfly, they could roll it on their feet and rub their feet together, and it's a hands-off application. So that's what I like to um, say about that. The third way is our whole line of Thieves products, from oral health care to dishwasher liquid, um, our laundry detergents, our floss, you name it. The blend that is Thieves is so powerful that it's crossed over into almost every lifestyle product we have for the most part, except maybe the skincare. So, and of course the hand sanitizer, right? There's a reason why it's going out of stock and coming back in stock and going out of stock. So that is my lowdown on Thieves. Many different uses, many different applications. Next up is Shannon, who's gonna talk about Raven. Which way are you? Okay, Shannon. Got it. <laughs> All right. Hey, friends. I am sharing about Raven. And Raven is one of our Breathe Deeply oils. And it is a blend of oils. And this blend is cam camphor, lemon, wintergreen, peppermint, and eucalyptus radiata. It just sounds like a fresh breath in a bottle, which is why I love it. Um, I was actually introduced to Raven um, in Stacy Van's uh, studio. Um, what year was that? I don't even know. Um, but it was way in the beginning and I was in uh, a yoga class and I was, um, uh, I was feeling challenged by some of the movements that were going on. I was very new. It was probably one of my very first yoga classes. And so I stopped to rest and there was a lovely person next to me who um, said, hey, like, are you doing okay? And I said, yeah, I'm just not used to this. Um, I, this is my first class. And she's like, here, I've got this oil for you. So she, and she's like, here, try this and put it on. And when I did, I'm just going to do it right now because it takes me back to that moment, right? And the moment... I put that on and I breathe it. I put it right onto my chest and onto my sides. And I immediately felt everything open. And being a person who is sometimes challenged by allergies or asthma, this was such a relief to me because um, it just brought this freshness. It brought this beautiful, calming relief of openness. And then I felt encouraged to continue the practice. And lo and behold, how many years later now, I, now I'm a teacher. Um, so having that support felt really good to me. And I'm just going to kind of share with you. We're going to um, go into this just a little bit more. So I'm going to put a little more on because that just wasn't enough. I want a little bit more. So I'm going to come to that scent tip. And when I close my eyes, I like to visualize the immense wingspan of a raven, These, this bird in flight. And as its wings open, I can feel my breath and my rib cage open wide. I feel exhilarated. I feel fresh. 
And as I inhale, I can feel the openness. And as I exhale, I can feel my body release. It also helps me to feel calm in my mind and trust my body that my breath knows exactly what it's supposed to do. And I can trust that inhale and I can trust that that exhale is coming and going. This practice helps me through challenging moments in my life, whether I'm e-learning homeschooling with my kid or whether I'm faced with some kind of challenge. I love to go to Raven because it helps me breathe through those moments. And when I think of that Raven bird, it flies high and it can see far and wide. So it helps me mentally open my own perspective to see that my story or the situation is bigger than what's feeling in the moment. And I can take that bigger perspective and trust that there's a bigger picture and that, that everything works out the way it's supposed to be. In that opening, I can feel all those minty scents and the eucalyptus coming through and offering a cleansing feeling, that lemon and uh, peppermint wintering. It just offers this cleansing of, for me, very emotionally, um, cleansing those emotions and allowing me to move forward with a new beginning and a fresh start. So obviously Raven is here to support our healthy respiratory system. Um, I also love to use it in a hot compress, um, like Julie uh, Mackey had mentioned using hot compresses. Our family is big on hot compresses. Um, it allows the body to really just absorb that rapidly. So I like to place it on my lungs or I like to add that hot compress to my feet. Um, I also love uh, as a raindrop technique practitioner and teacher, I love to add Raven to the raindrop technique, whether I'm doing this for myself or with others. Um, raindrop, uh, raindrop and ra Raven is a great um, one to just bring into that process. And my last favorite thing to use Raven is in the diffuser. I love Raven in the diffuser because everything that I just mentioned can be shared with my entire household. So when I see that my daughter who is studying at school at the, you know, at the table and I can see she's, she gets kind of stuck in her mind, her one tunnel mind about maybe not being able to move forward. I like to put Raven in that to help open her perspective to see that it's just one small step, one foot in front of the other. And soon she'll get through it and she can move through that with this openness that we talked about. So that's how I love to use Raven, one of my faves. I'm gonna then toss out Lemon to Annette. Ready? Are you unmuted? Here you go, Annette. Thanks, Shannon. Okay, everybody, I'm gonna talk about um, lemon vitality oil. One of my favorite oils, super versatile, multi-use oil. Um, one of the things that I use this for is we love lemon chicken in our house and I like really lemony chicken and I don't usually have enough lemons. Um, so I use a drop a drop of this in my um, in my broth before I pour it over my chicken breast to, to give me extra lemon in my lemon chicken. Um, like to drink this in my water, and, and you guys know that if you drink any essential oil in water, you always use a glass or a stainless steel container. Never use plastic with an essential oil. Um, I also keep this in my laundry room. I wash my laundry with free and clear laundry and I have all of my oils lined up and I put this in my laundry quite often. Um, a lot of my towels I use this with, my sheets and just one or two drops in with my laundry detergent um, for, fresh, for fresh laundry. Um, what else? Oh, and it is one of my most favorite things also is a lifesaver. We use this for stickers. Anything that's sticky in your house, this will take it off. Um, not too long ago, Annie had her favorite sweatshirt and she put a sticker on it, put it in the dryer and the sticker came out. It was like all melted all over the front of the shirt. So I took lemon oil, poured it all over, peeled the sticker off, rewashed it. Sticker was gone. And of course, because there's no added carrier oils to these little bottles, 
Um, there was no stain on the sweatshirt and she was super happy because her favorite sweatshirt was saved by mom and lemon essential oil. Um, and then just one more thing I want, cause I, I pulled out my book and I wanted to like give myself a little refresher for lemon. Cause sometimes I feel like I take my oils, um, I take them for granted. You know, they're just part of my daily life. I've been using them for so long. And so this kind of struck me. I like this little, this little, um, blurb. And if you guys don't have the essential oil dust reference, I suggest you get one from life science publishing. But one of the things that it said is it promotes clarity of thought and purpose with a fragrance that is invigorating, enhancing, and warming. University researchers in Japan found that diffusing certain aromas in an office, office environment dramatically improved mental acuity and concentration. Diffused lemon resulted in 54% fewer errors. When aromas were diffused during test taking, scores increased by as much as 50%. So just a little shout out to lemon and, you know, using it, <laughs> especially when all your kids are home now yeah. and sitting at the table <laughs> trying to get all of their homework done. So and with that, um, next up is Dawn with Citrus Fresh. Are you ready, Dawn? I'm ready. All right, here it comes. Got it. So I have Citrus Fresh. It is one of our signature blends and it is in the category of bring the sunshine in. I love Citrus Fresh because I happen to be allergic to garlic. And if you've ever looked at bottled salad dressing in the grocery store, pretty much every salad dressing ever made has garlic in it. And so we always make our own salad dressings at my house and putting a little bit of citrus fresh into the salad dressing brings it to life and gives you the tastiest salad. The combination of this blend is orange, tangerine, grapefruit, lemon, mandarin orange, and spearmint. And I'm telling you that little bit of spearmint in there just makes it so fresh and refreshing. So a couple other ways that you could use your citrus fresh. One of them obviously is you could put it in your diffuser to just diffuse liquid sunshine into your home. You could use it as a really powerful odor eliminator. So if you notice that your car is starting to smell like a locker room because you're doing all your workouts and getting in your car to drive home, still sweaty and smelly, you could just take your citrus fresh and sprinkle a few drops around your car. You could sprinkle it into the bottom of your shoes or you could spray it into a gym bag. It's a really nice odor eliminator. If you're not familiar with purification, it's another one of our blends that's also an amazing odor eliminator. And then another Another thing that you could do is you could purchase our unscented shower gel from Young Living and you could add citrus fresh and maybe a little bit of extra spearmint or a little extra peppermint or a little extra lemon or orange and give that bottle a good shake and have a very beautiful morning shower gel. So with that being said, I need to throw lavender to Julie. Are you ready? Here ready. it comes. Thanks. <laughs> so Lavender, I am so excited that I get to talk about the queen. They say the queen of essential oils is lavender and the king is frankincense, which is coming after this. And the funniest thing about essential oils for me is that Panaway and lavender were the first two oils I was ever introduced to. And I just randomly kind of, I didn't think about that until later. So, um, being a yoga teacher for athletes, I was really, really happy to hear about this testimonial from a professional uh, major league baseball pitcher who started putting lavender on the laces of his mitt. So every time he went to do the windup, he would catch a scent of that lavender. And it's so calming and there's documenting um, how it helps with concentration also. And if it can do that calming feeling for him to stay in the present moment and play that game and, and excel at the best of his ability, think what it can also do for you. Um, the three things that I really like about lavender, maybe I have four, <laughs> so I'll make them quick. The first thing I do, and I love this every 
night I get into bed, I wash, well, I don't wash my sheets every night. But when I wash my sheets, I put a couple drops of lavender on my wool dryer balls. And I also do that with my towels. So when I get out of the shower, I love to wrap myself up and smell that. And when I lay down to bed, I love when I can smell lavender. Um, I also really love lavender as a skin soother. So I'll put a few drops in my body lotion. And I love to have it diffused in my room at night when I'm falling asleep. The other um, thing that works really well for me too, I'm a fan of lavender so much that this comes in a vitality oil as well. And I put it in lavender, I make lavender lemonade. So those are the best versions of lavender I can think of. And the other thing that you really need to be aware of is lavender is the most adulterated, synthetically made, essential oil out there in the market. So when you go to um, retail stores and you see it on the shelf and it looks so enticing to buy, it most likely is not 100% therapeutic grade A quality. So keep that in mind and discern for yourself what's the best for you. And with that, I will pass frankincense over to Pam, you ready? Oh, now she's on mute. <laughs> You're on mute still. Unmute yourself. I did. I couldn't catch it. You threw it so fast, Jules, with those big muscles from CrossFit. What up? All right. So that frankincense is mine, and frankincense is my buddy. I call him my buddy Frank. When I started using oils, I got the Ancient Oils of the Bible kit. Is, was my first purchase along with the Golden Touch One Kit. So my first two oils for myself that I started using back in 2003 was Frankincense and Raven and Shannon did a beautiful job of explaining Raven. So Frankincense became my buddy. This bottle of Frankincense is one of our more high priced bottles. So when I was brand new I thought it was pretty expensive and I couldn't get over that I have to tell my husband that if I run out of this bottle, became such a good friend of mine that I used every, I wanted to use every day, but didn't feel like I could because I thought, oh my gosh, I don't want to run out of it very, very fast. So some of you that are new, you may feel that same way, but I'm going to tell you a story that makes it worth every single penny. I would use this just on Saturdays and Sundays. And I want to clarify how to use these topically. When you use this topically, you're only using one to three drops. So this little bottle here could have up to 250, sometimes 300 drops in here, depending on the thickness of the oil. So that's a lot of drops. So, but I was using it sparingly. So one to two to three drops max. And I would put it on the top of my head and rub it through my hair, just like this. Got to make sure that little atomizer's there. Drop it on and then waft my hands through my hair and then take my scent tent. And when I would go to church and do my sporting activities with my two boys and go to church on Sundays, people were complimenting me left and right. They were saying, you glow, you shine. How are you so joyful all the time? Your attitude is amazing. And they would say all this and my husband started hearing them and they were, he was like, you know, you are kind of different on the weekends. What What's going on on the weekends? And he, I told him, I said, well, only thing I can think of is this little bottle of frankincense that I'm using. And he says, but why are you using that only on the weekends? And I told him, well, it's rather pricey in my opinion. And I just didn't want you to say, oh no, you're done with that. And he goes, oh no, it's making such a difference in your world that you buy as many bottles of that as you like and wear that every single day. And so that's what I have done ever since 2003. This is my buddy Frank. And so those feelings, those mood swings, the nervous system fluctuations that we go through, because in my history, I would call myself the happy, depressed person. If you read my book, Rise and Shine, Six or Ma Six Master Steps to Get Moving, it totally goes into detail about how I lived that way for so many years. And through yoga and meditation and mindfulness practices and self-care and little bottles of love, I call these, this little Frank, 
that has completely shifted for me. So with that, he's worth every little cent. And I hope you try him out on a daily basis and watch yourself shift and change. So I want to clarify also, I think it's pretty confusing, the white and the colorful labels. The white labels are only in the U.S. market and they are to help us realize that these are gross, generally regarded as safe to ingest. But my friends, these are exactly the same thing. They are exactly, so if you want to ingest the colorful label, go right ahead. The oil is exactly the same. All that the white label means is that for those of us that educate, that we can only hold up this white bottle and say, okay, ingest this. But I really think that's kind of changing since the whole world doesn't have the white bottles. That if you say this and it has a partner friend that has the white labels in the U.S., then you can do whatever you want to with either one because they're exactly the same oil. I'm going to say that three times. These are exactly the same oil. These are exactly the same oil. And as a matter of fact, one of the ways I like to use frankincense already pre-blended for me is in the blend of longevity. Many of you that got the promos got a bottle of longevity. It comes with a white friend. It comes with a white label friend. So with that, they're interchangeable. So how I like, there's in this longevity, there's frankincense, thyme, orange, and clove. So this is a beautiful way to ingest your essential oils for amazing benefits on a daily basis. So if you're wondering how to use this longevity, put it in a capsule, maybe put some olive oil with the capsule as well. Maybe three drops is all you need. Maybe a few drops, put it in there and take one a day. It helps release the puffiness inside of you, the tension. And we had longevity capsules for many, many years. They've been out of stock for a long time now. So we make our own. So frankincense can be ingested all by itself, which I like a little frank under my tongue. I, I don't want to waste it by mixing it in with anything that isn't another oil blend that has extra special goodness. So I hope you enjoy exploring with your frankincense and know that it is not expensive at at all because your health is worth every penny of investment you can put in it. So who am I passing to? I am going to Jojo with Stress Away. Where are you Jojo? There you are way up there. Got it? Here it comes. There you go. Got to unmute. All right. Stress Away. Nobody needs this nowadays, right? Show of hands. Nobody needs this. Okay. Stress away oil, my personal testimonial. It was my favorite, favorite smelling oil when I got my starter kit, and here's why. I love vanilla. I missed vanilla candles. I missed vanilla shower gel from Bath and Body Works. I knew after my son was given an autism diagnosis that I had to get rid of all the chemicals in my home, and Bath and Body Works was my buddy every time that yellow duck sale would come and they give you the big blue bag that housed like, I don't know how much, but I would throw all my faves in there and know that I had just, you know, hit the mother load. Well, then that just, it stopped at a halt. So Stress Away is this wonderful blend of, well, there's a lot of oils in this, but the, the smell I picked up was vanilla. And I also love citrus fruits. I'm the person that puts salt on a lemon and can suck it right down. So when I first took the smell, I thought, oh, this is fantastic. It smells amazing. No, that it didn't come in a bottle. It only came in a roll-on back in the day. So this became my new perfume and just rolled it behind the ears on the, anywhere you know you would put a perfume. But the reason why Gary Young just decided to put it in a bottle so we could diffuse it is because of all the wonderful benefits from when we inhale our oils, how they work on us systemically and emotionally. And that's something you can read about also in your reference guide. So Stress Away Oil is lime, vanilla, lavender, copaiba, cedarwood, and okatea. And all the, the combination of those oils, it, it's a very mild smelling oil, but you can pick up like the pungency, if you will, in the lime I feel more in the roll-on than in 
the, um, the bottle to diffuse. So anytime I'm diffusing an oil that has citrus, I generally make sure there's at least 13 to 15 drops in the diffuser. Always keep in mind the size of your room because they're lighter. So you may not smell it right away or feel like it's strong enough. So feel free to, to do about 15 drops. So three ways to use, obviously to diffuse, just to keep a zen atmosphere in your home. Always look at what the label says, that's what it's for, right? Carry it in your purse whenever you need it. Put a little bit right on your wrist, like I said, behind the ears, or use your portable purse size stress away that's already diluted. And the third way is as a perfume. You may wanna try it if you have it and see what you think about it. I pick up the vanilla and I, I like I said, that's my go-to. I prefer vanilla ice cream over chocolate, by the way because I just love the smell of vanilla. So if you know anybody that's a candle burner and wants to break the habit, but they, they can't get rid of their vanilla candles, stress away. And they're gonna get more benefits along with it. So with that, let's see. Oh, Shannon, it's you again. She's doing peace and calming. Are you ready? Yep. There you go. Yes. Okay, cool. So peace and calming. Well, let's see. I'll be honest with you. I am not a big, big fan of vanilla, but Stress Away has grown on me. Stress Away has been the one to kind of change my mind about vanilla, but I've never been much of a vanilla fan for me. And so here's another alternative. This peace and calming does exactly what it says it does. So like Stress Away, it's going to offer you all those benefits, but peace and calming it's got a really different uh, smell to it. And I love it because it's, it's sweet and earthy at the same time, but not too earthy. So it is a blend of oils that has tangerine, orange, ylang-ylang, patchouli, and blue tansy. So just by those oils alone, you can tell it is going to be really grounding and um, give you that sense of just tranquility. Um, this is an everyday fave in my family's life. Um, I began to start using a lot uh, to manage challenging days at work um, back when I was a corporate manager. And then it really became essential uh, after I left the corporate world and became a mom. <laughs> so this was my go-to. Um, I used it all through my labor. And it was definitely the main oil I used multiple times a day after um, having a baby and being a new mom. So as we know, um, for me, being a new mom was amazing. One of the most beautiful gifts in the world. But I also found it really challenging with uh, the lack of sleep and all the stress of making all these new decisions and just kind of adjusting to life this new way. So um, there was a lot of feelings that I felt um, where things were, a lot of things felt kind of out of my control. And um, I remember to use my tools. So I would go to my peace and calming. And I said, well, I know I have control over one thing. And that was my go-to. I could take that bottle and I would drop a few drops in my hands and I would pause and I would breathe. And this pause became the greatest moment of my day for myself. This was my essential self-care and it literally was just maybe three breaths worth. But that's all I had the energy for. <laughs> right? That's all I could really manage. Um, and it was the most important, beautiful part of my day, um, other than being a mom and watching my child. But for me, it made me feel like me again. I was able to find peace in myself and calmness in myself. Um, and I love that I had a, a tool in the palm of my hand to get there. Now, one other thing that uh, my husband at first was not totally on board with all the oils. He was like, oh, there's definitely some smells going on. And that was about it. Well, when I first started leaving the house, you know, like going to Target and just like walking through the aisles for two hours, not even buying anything, just getting out of the house kind of thing. <laughs> you know, well, my husband was like, oh my gosh, well, what do I do? Well, 
he started using peace and calming because when she would cry and he knew all she wanted was mom and mama's milk and you know that he was like, I don't have what she needs. And I say, yes, you do. And he figured it out all by himself. He started putting on peace and calming. And even if it didn't calm her down, <laughs> it calmed him down so he could be that peace and calm in her world. And over time now, my daughter's eight years old now. And to this day, when she, when he puts on peace and calming or anytime she smells peace and calming, she automatically thinks of Papa. And you know, his favorite place to put peace and calming was in his big bushy beard. That was his diffuser. <laughs> all right. And I knew he was using it because I went to go use it one day and it was gone. And I was like, where did it go? And he's like, yeah, you need some more of that. <laughs> and then he was hooked. So his diffuser is his beard and peace and calming he has his very own now and he keeps me updated when it needs to be refilled. So peace and calming is so uplifting. It gives you that fresh citrus sense, but it's also really grounding and helps you just be that calm in the chaos. Um, it's one of my faves, but I will say one little tidbit about peace and calming is that it is photosensitive. Okay. So if you're at the beach, that's not the time and the place to apply it to where the sun's shining on you right then and there, okay? So if you're gonna apply it, place it where the sun isn't gonna shine or do it with a, some time in, in between. But on the beach, applying that is not the time and place for a photosensitive oil. And not everyone has that reaction, but um, I have uh, just wanted to say that this does have some photosensitivity. So put it where the sun ain't gonna shine if you're on the beach. <laughs> And the next thing I'm going to toss out to, oh, I got this big thing here. Oh, my God. <laughs> Dawn, are you ready for it? Oh, I'm going to try. Okay, ready? Go. Got it. Hey, this is that beautiful box that Pamela opened at the beginning. So she pulled on the beautiful golden ribbon and showed you all of those beautiful oils. But what she didn't get a chance to talk about was the other beautiful golden ribbon, which reveals a treasure trove underneath it. So don't forget to open it or don't let your new people forget to open it because it is filled with goodies. So let's start with talking about the pocket. A lot of people ignore the pocket because they think it's just paraphernalia that they're not interested in, but there are really cool educational pieces at your fingertips here in the pocket. So this is the lifestyle book. It tells you about essential rewards. It tells you about some of the lines of products, additional information from what you find in your product guide. And then how about these little packets? This is Ninja Red. Ninja Red is our superfood puree. It is whole food nutrition. It comes in packet form in your premium starter kit, or you could purchase it in the bottle form once you totally get hooked on it and you get on essential rewards and it's coming to your door every month. I love Ninja Red because I do not particularly like swallowing pills. I, I can do it and I do do it, but I don't really enjoy it. So if I can get my vitamins and minerals, amino acids, antioxidants, polysaccharides, B vitamins in a delicious, nutritious liquid form, I'm all in. So get these out of your box. You might want to chill them in your refrigerator. Summer's coming. You can even freeze them in the freezer and eat them as a Ninja Red Sickle, and it is delicious. In the bottom of the, of the box, you will find two oils, and those we've already talked about with you. Joanna talked about Stress Away. Shannon talked about Peace and Calming. So don't miss those. Those are your 11 and 12 oils that are down in the special secret compartment. In that compartment, you will also find what are called roller fitments. And if you can see on the top of this bottle, I have a roller top on it. So in my kit, I've already chosen to put my roller tops on two bottles. You get to choose which bottle you put your roller top on. It's really pretty easy to do. All you have to do is take one of your oil bottles and you can remove this reducer top, a little trick I like to do to remove it is to just barely put a cap on and you catch the edge of it and your little reducer top comes right off. 
Then you'll put your new black fitment on it. And don't worry about pushing it down all the way because you would have to use a lot of muscles to do it. All you have to do to get your cap to seat on there is put that little fitment on there and then screw your cap on tight. And as you go that last notch, you'll hear a little click and it will be in there tight. So don't miss out on using those fitments. They are amazing. And then treasure of all treasures, we've got the Thieves <laughs> Hand Sanitizer, super popular. It's like liquid gold right now. Get your Thieves Hand Sanitizer, get it in your purse, get more when it's available, which I actually think it is right now, get some. And then this is the Thieves Spray. The Thieves Spray is powerful. It has denatured alcohol in it, so it does extra duty for getting rid of the things that we don't like that are lingering. So I like to use it on surfaces. You could spray it on the grocery cart handles. I keep it in my car right now. Often, I just like to spray it on my hands, clean up my hands. And then what my trick is, sometimes I've touched my key or I've touched my credit card if I've gone to the store and I know that they're a germy and so I just spray down my key fob and I spray down my credit card before they go into my purse because I don't take my purse or my phone into the store with me anymore when I go in there and then I like to spray my steering wheel and wipe that down with a paper towel so you will love your thieves hand sanitizer and your thieves spray. And so I think I am going to toss the kit to Julie. Can you catch? Where are you, Julie? Here you go. <laughs> oh, thank you, Dawn. That was a good throw. So I'm gonna tell you just um, briefly how to get a kit. If you have, um, you want to order a second kit or you want to sign someone up under you. Um, I guess this will only work if you're brand new and I'm going to go through what, how to become a member. So you're going to go to youngliving.com and select the country that you are from. And at the top corner will say become a member. You would click on that area. It would be best if you also had on file the person who introduced you to Young Living's member ID number, because it's going to ask you later who that person who referred you is, and you would want to type in those numbers. Next, you'll pick the kit that you would like to purchase, and there's several different kits. There's a premium starter kit that comes with the diffuser and all the oils that you just saw here. There's also a CBD kit. There's a thieves kit. There's a Ninja Red kit. There are other various kits that I may be missing right now or that they may add on in the future. So look through all the little tabs. There's a basic kit for someone who just wants to get that wholesale membership and not want to purchase a huge bundle of things yet. Um, so you would select that next, clicking on the tabs, and then you would go to the next question, which would say, would you like to enroll as a Central Rewards into that program. And Central Rewards, I will be passing on to Joanna in a second, but before I do, you will decide if you want to make your premium starter kit or whatever kind of kit you'd like to purchase as your first Central Rewards purchase. And then Joanna will explain why you would want to do that. So you ready, Joe? Give me a high five over there. I was gonna say. You're not throwing anything at me. Okay, <laughs> by show of hands, am I unmuted? Yes, I am. Who is on Young Living's Essential Rewards Program? Donna, Gina, beautiful. So I'll, I'll review. So we know rewards programs are every single place we turn. <clears throat> the apps, the amount of apps on the phone for anywhere from Noodles and Company to Starbucks, well, Young Living <clears throat> rewards us as well for choosing to live a healthy lifestyle and to choosing to do the ditch and switch of products for ourselves and our family and supporting our bodies, our minds, and our spirits. So I like to call it a monthly wellness box with Young Living Oils and Lifestyle products of your choice that you earn free product points for. It's super flexible. You can change the date. It is a monthly shipment and it's Christmas every month. 
Anybody else agree? Like who gets mad when their husband opens their ER box? I kind of get upset. Um, but anyway, it's a minimum 50 PV order. PV means product value. So if the stress away is $22, the PV is 22. Generally, everything in the product guide that you find is typically equal PV to dollar amount, other than our Animal Sense line and our diffusers and our starter kits. Used to be Ninja Red, but it's equal PV. Ninja Red is equal PV. That's a wonderful thing. So <clears throat> the perks of being on Essential Rewards is you do get discounted shipping. You get free product promotions that change monthly. And so the more you order, the more free product you get. And it is really how I built my oil collection. It's how I learned about oils I may have never thought to purchase, such as a longevity. It's like, what's longevity? You know, why, why, I need lavender. You know, I need my stress away. We always resonate back toward those starter kit oils, but please, before you ship out your auto ship, look at how much you've spent. Don't be the person that's $2 away from earning a free oil because you'll kick yourself. So we try to support you and, and keep that in mind when we're watching. Like, we don't see what you order. We're not, you know, stalking you in that way, but we want you to get the best bang for your buck and to expand your repertoire of oils and products. So here's how it works. Month one through three that you are on rewards, you earn 10% back in points that goes up in the upper left-hand corner of your screen when you go into your essential rewards or actually on your dashboard, okay? Month four through 24, you earn 20% back. So if you're placing just 50 PV, that's it. You're still earning between months four and 24, $10 back. And month 25 onward, you earn 25% back on everything you order. And there's not a store in the world you're going to get that type of return on for products that are so safe and wonderful to use. At months 3, 6, 9, and 12, Young Living gifts you with a free oil. They change it up, so I'm not going to tell you for sure what it is. In the past, it's been like a Vitality Peppermint and maybe a Thieves, but always something wonderful. And after one year, you get an exclusive loyalty blend that our founder created to thank us all for being so loyal to not only Young Living, but mostly to ourselves and our wellness. And it's beautiful. It comes in this lovely purple satin little uh, sachet or pouch, and it smells divine. I'm not sure what that has in it offhand. Um, so really and truly, when you are living the lifestyle and not just doing oils, because there's so much more to what Young Living has to offer other than the oils, but the beauty is our oils are infused in every single product that we have. Supplements to make them go quicker into the body, our skincare line, to you know, eliminate anything that you're gonna find over the counter and all of those, those nasty chemicals that are found underneath the fragrance button. If you could push that fragrance button, if it was a button on all of those ingredients you see in most over the counter products, you, they don't have to reveal what's in them. But Young Living doesn't have a fragrance word in any of their ingredients and that's a beautiful thing. So whether you have teenagers or young you know, infants, <clears throat> you know you can always feel really safe that you are working with a company that provides us the purest, cleanest products, I believe, on the market, infused with God's you know, natural energy and God's natural fragrance and all the benefits that come from these wonderful bottles, as Pamela says, of love, that were the very first things that we went to for our health, well, health and wellness and wealth, actually, <laughs> thousands of, <clears throat> excuse me, thousands of years ago. So the Essential Rewards program is something I encourage you to do if you're not. And all you do is try a new product every month. Try a lotion. You know, try our new Vitality Drops. Try a roll-on you've never tried. That's the only way you're going to discover for yourself and for your family what makes that shift and give it time and you'll feel the difference, I promise you. So with that, I believe we are winding up and Pamela, I am going to give it back to you. So thanks everybody. Thanks guys. Didn't they do a beautiful job? This is so fun educating as a community that we are. And uh, I just want to wrap up by saying um, the community is very important to us. And through the community, there's different people that are interested in different products. So, so often 
we find that people don't really explore unless we guide them to explore the entire product line of Young Living. That we are an essential oil company, but all of our supplements are infused with essential oils. Our Ninja Red and our Thieves and our home care line are all infused with essential oils, but we have so much going on. I'll show you this little picture of all the different products that are going on within Young Living. So if you haven't gone to the Young Living website lately and gone to the categories, to the actual shopping cart of all the different categories and just pushed the buttons around and noticed that we have savvy mineral makeup, so many nutritional supplements, we have a weight management program. We have beautiful personal care and I will tell you you want to be a part of convention because personal care products are going to be launched all new packaging all new bundles we have so many new bundles that are out right now that just came out this week that you gotta check out so if you're not in our fun loving oils Oilers wellness page make sure you find that page talk to the person that introduced you to oils or message me and let's get you in that group so you can see all the latest and greatest the men's care is amazing this baby care is amazing the animal sense the kids sense it just keeps going we have einkorn last night in the middle of the night I wasn't feeling too great and felt like it was a digestive thing and I was like maybe I need to eat something in the middle of the night and this is a girl that usually in intermittent fast and I ate our einkorn flakes in the middle of the night and let me tell you it tasted so amazing <laughs> to have a midnight snack so we have pastas and all these glorious foods to make pancakes and make your bread from home so I just want to say to you the community is vast within our community our team here I call us community because I think it's a, a real unifying effort and I love that unity is part of community and so come together with us bring more people you know you may not be into the business side of this to have this full-fledged business but to share and tell people how to get these wonderful products and this wonderful love into their life is really a, a beautiful gesture I think of it as paying forward my passion runs deep Woo! for sharing with anyone and everyone I I can so I you know I get I get over, oh, not overwhelmed, how do I get, I get so full that the spiritual emotion welds up in me because I realize all the people that I have shared with and they have introduced me to so many people they have shared with. And then, oh, it just becomes this little tap on the heart and tap on wellness and tap on self-care that it just keeps growing that we are serving so many people. So be a part of that share with us. This video will be um, available so that you can just share it out there and just be a part of it all because we would love to have you and share love with you on a daily basis. So that wraps up our presentation but we'll be here. I'm going to stop the recording and I'm we're going to